Sure ULX wireless systems are designed for professional musicians and sound system installers with advanced features and the ability to configure larger systems. Watch how easy it is to set up a ULX system. Connect the power supply to the back of the receiver and plug it into a standard AC power outlet. Attach the two antennas to the jacks labeled Antenna A and Antenna B on the back of the receiver. For best reception, angle the antennas apart in a wide V. Switch the receiver's power button on. The display on the front of the receiver should light up. Connect the audio output of the receiver to an input on your audio mixer. Or connect the audio output of the receiver to the input on your guitar amp. Next, we need to select a channel on the receiver. Press the Mode button on the receiver. The words Scan Channel will appear on the display. Rotate the control knob a quarter turn clockwise. The next open channel number will appear on the display. Press the Set button to tune the receiver to that channel. If you're using more than one ULX system, they all need to be set to different channels but the same group. You can have the receiver figure out which group has the most clear channels in your area. Details on how to do this are in the user guide. Install a fresh 9-volt battery in the transmitter. If your wireless system is being used with an electric guitar, plug the supplied instrument cable into your guitar and into the body pack transmitter. The ULX body pack transmitter has both an input level adjustment and an input attenuator switch, so you can tweak the system for great sound quality with any voice or instrument. The input attenuator switch will normally be set at 0 dB when used with microphones and most instruments. Set the switch to minus 20 dB if you have a guitar with high output active electronics. Now we need to set the transmitter to the same channel as the receiver. First, turn the transmitter on and press and hold the mode button on the transmitter until only the group number is visible. Then press the set button to advance the channel number until it matches the receiver's channel. Press the Mode button again to save the new channel setting. The new group and channel settings will appear on the display. Now let's check the audio by talking into the microphone or playing a few chords on the guitar. The green or amber audio LEDs on the receiver should flicker. If the red LED goes on steadily, we need to turn the transmitter input gain down. If only one or two green LEDs light up, we need to turn the input gain up. If you have more than one ULX system, set all of the other receivers to the same group as the first one. Then, while the first transmitter is on, let the second receiver scan for an open channel. Set the second transmitter to match the second receiver. Repeat this process for the remaining systems. For more information about Shure ULX wireless systems, visit Shure.com.